Okay, for my page map level four entry, I can see that bit one is set, or sorry, bit zero is set. So this is three, so that would be zero, zero, one, one. So present bit is set, that is as expected. Read write bit is one because this is three, so one, one. So one means that it's writable, so it's readable, writable. And sorry, I should say that the present bit of equal to one up here is referenced as a V here in WinDebug's output, valid output. So they provide you little sort of mnemonics here to try to make it easier so that you don't have to always parse the entries using the raw bit fields. So V for valid and W for writable and user supervisor bit, what's set there? Well, that is zero. So that means not user, but only supervisor. So zero is supervisor, which is K for kernel down here in the wind debug output. And then XD at the most significant bit, you can see that that is not set and therefore it is executable. So it's not not executable, it's not execute disabled, so it's executable. And then what is the physical address of the page directory pointer table based on this entry? Well, it was these middle bits here and we said the 12 bits right here are used as flags. So you can just basically ignore the 12 bits. So drop off the last four hex nibbles and it's just four nine zero nine zero zero zero. So you just assume zeros for the bottom. That's the physical address, four nine zero nine zero zero zero. So that's how you would interpret this page map level for entry. There's also this PFN page frame number 49094909. And that is a different sort of Windows data structure that can talk about you know, how that particular physical frame is used. And you would learn more about that in the future Windows operating systems internals class.